Been to Harry Well Vets in Folkestone to get the little lady. I'll pick up her animal health certificate. Such a simple process, and it's such a good price. Parking was pretty easy as well. Wasn't no, it was right behind. We're no yeah. good with the caravan on, so we stayed at uh, Black Horse Farm last night, didn't we? Yeah. We're ready to set off early tomorrow. So we just come down to the harbour in Folkestone and uh, gonna have a look round, see what we can see. Yeah, Ooh, with little, little winder. She's having a bit of a whinge this morning. Not happy, are you? Oh dear. Well, she whinges about everything, really. She's <laughs> a baby. Uh, <laughs> right, let's go have a look then. Okay. Over in the distance, a bit of sea mist coming in now. A lot of renovation work going on around here. No tram train, tram station's been renovated. Here has been renovated. Do you need renovation, my dear? No, I don't do it. No, you don't. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Way over in the distance around that corner is Dover. We're not going to see that. It's a little bit misty.
What's the time? Quarter seven. We made it to the tunnel. Check in. We got through the first bit. We're off to pet reception now. Uh, let's see what we can find here. Around that way? Yeah. Let's go and have a look now. I've watched a lot of video. Or vlogs on YouTube about how to get through this system but when we've come here today there are barriers and diversions everywhere so it's a bit like starting from scratch uh, hey ho we'll get there we've popped into the pet exercise area uh, which is also temporarily relocated it's across from where across the road from where it used to be I think you can see some of the work that's going on here. No idea what they're doing, but we managed to get on an earlier train. I need to take in there. Anything. Just take. 
So here we go. We're on our way. <laughs> Ule Ule. Bit nerve wracking, isn't it? There's Bubbo. He's sitting there nicely now. There's Paul. He's sitting there nicely too. right lane for the um, caravan though. Yeah, well, I think that changes when we get around the corner here. Okay. <coughs> we'll find out in a minute. It's quite quiet though, isn't it? It is really. Goodbye, you are now crossing the border. Au revoir. Bonjour. Make sure you have your passports ready. Hello. Bonjour, ça va. So I went to grab a coffee. And when I come back, all the caravans had gone where we were parked. Yeah, I was, I was hoping we could follow someone. <laughs> but the car park was empty when she come back. Are you getting excited or nervous? Both. I just said it wasn't very busy, but we're in the queue now. <laughs> Put a kiss of death on that one. That's because they'd already gone, darling. Oh well, we'll get there. We actually managed to get on the earlier train, haven't we? 10 to 8. Instead of the 8.30? Or 8.25? Eight, yeah, 8.20 that should have been, but we've managed to get on the 10 to 8. We've got to use all five lanes, it says, but they're, they're mostly closed, look. Yeah. Use all five lanes. Catch you in a bit. We've passed the French passport control and hopefully just one more stop to tell you what lane you've got to get in and we will be on Duck Tree Inn. That's quite straightforward, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So far, so good. I'm still wondering about getting this eight foot wide caravan on that train, though. <laughs> Coming through some of them little checkpoints, what we've just been through, it's, don't get a huge amount of room. See where we are. Yeah. Now we've got to stop again. Hello. Yeah, lane 16. 16, yeah. We're now heading towards the train. What are they waiting for? Oh, they do have, they have a different train? Yeah. Oh, 
hands are all open, signed it or something. Yeah. I don't know. I've got a couple of lorries up there. The game. I think little Bobo's getting a little bit impatient. Hi, Bobo. Hey, get impatient. Hey, good girl. Hey. Now you being a good boy? Trying to be. Surprise me if they stop the next one. They're letting the car through. That's yours. Nice watch me up. Fudging ya. Still fudging ya. Come on. Stop. We're so near yet so far. Yeah. Got a lot of room to get through there, though, have you? That's what I mean. <laughs> oh my word! I won't say I'm nervous. <laughs> Drive if you want. No, that's all right, darling. I've got time to switch seats. No. Are you telling me you're nervous? To no, make... no. <laughs> Did you just say this was what you've been dreading? No. <laughs> There's times like this you think, why did we buy a very long caravan which is extra wide? See how good that camera is? Yeah. So clear. That one fitted. Maybe this guy is going to guide us on, or maybe yeah. not. What are you going to do? Get on further and then. Yeah, I've got to go further, further, further. What, here? Right, here we go. Here we go. Well, we're on. Too hard, darling. Was it? So we just got to keep driving now until we come to the end. 
drive to France, shall we? Well, we're not under the tunnel yet, are we? They're huge trains, aren't they? Massive. Huge. See behind? Hold on camera. That sounded more scary than it was to be fair. next one now. Okay. So she looks a little bit nervous now. Well, I can honestly say, well done to you, sir. We're in. You've done an amazing job. No going back now. No. Nope. But we've got our little girl to. I don't think I might just hold her for a little while.
followed by an evacuation announcement. On hearing the alarm signal, you should move directly to the next carriage. This is a precautionary measure while the shuttle continues its crossing. Thank you for your attention. Welcome. My window's not open. Mesdames et messieurs, votre attention s'il vous plaît. Here we go. Here we go. Welcome to France.